Fifty. Yes, it's been a tough day, and I mean a tough day. New York City has issued a frigid, cold air temperature warning, which will be on tonight. And most of all, this is going to be a deaf man storm, and this could be a probably a polar vortex, maybe. Because this is going to be a very frigid, t cold temperatures. Then when we go in the next weekend, we get an advisory to a warning. And this is not really good. This is not really good. This is a very mean, mean cold that's going to be hitting our air. And this is why. Snow showers. And covering to like a feet, maybe. But not as a feet. But bringing it as less of an inch. Flat inch. But this is... A little accumulation of snow, but making this temperature feel like it's a below temperature. Wind chills are below temperatures. And this is not really as a feat. This is just just a very extremely small inch of snow. I apologize for for saying a inch but uh, for feet, but there's snow showers. And most of all, the worst thing you can imagine is how f how it's Oh my god, this is not good. You can't even hardly see the trees from far away. And most of all, you can see these snow showers moving really fast. It's like a heavy snow showers. And most of all, you can think of, it's like it's covering to an inch or feet. Looking like it's covering the whole area. This is not really good. And this is very, extremely bad. Why? Because these cold temperatures are not even going to stop all of us. This is just going to keep going, keep going, keep going, and keep going. Once we go to these other weekends, we'll probably get nice temperatures. But not really, because Monday, we'll get advisory to a warning of another snowstorm on Monday. And the worst thing you can imagine is that more snow is still falling. And it could piss people off. Piss people off. This is a winter weather advisory message. And we have issued a gale watch. This is not going to be very, very, very good. This is going to be a very extremely bad, bad, bad temperatures. And just look at it. How you could think how bad a snow shower is. This is just only an AM, AM snow shower. So this will be ending after p.m. p.m. will will be bringing a sunny day. But look at this snow, how it's falling right now. This is going to be a struggle, a very big struggle, because Friday is no school, because 78%, and just imagine, 78%. And also, the worst thing you could think of is that Thursday we get school while we're getting a bit of really cold that's hitting our area. But watch for the evening, afternoon to evening of tomorrow and to midnight, Thursday and Wednesday night, will be the boss of this very extremely cold temperatures. We got you all, everyone. Do not worry. On Friday, you will be staying home. If you high schoolers will be probably having school for Friday, and this is going to be very not fair. But everyone, please be very careful. Even cars, buses, MTAs, everything who are driving. Watch out. Not good. And also, we got your mobile devices. Everything you want to learn. If you want to see my Gmail, neogonzalez6141, agmail.com. And the worst of all is Chesapeake. This country has reached... And I'm not playing, everyone. I'm not playing. Go to the Weather Channel. Not playing. Not playing. The temperatures of Russia, of the other side of Chesapeake, has reached 100 degrees below. That's one of the highest, highest, highest temperatures recorded. One of the baddest, highest warning temperatures that, that they ever de devised. I'm Neil Gonzalez, Gonzalez, the Weather Channel. And please... Be very conscious. This is going to be very dangerous. And Governor Charlie did not accept it for, for, for no school on Friday. They want Governor Charlie wants to accept school on Friday. And all those presidents and governments said no. Because this is going to be a very exotic situation. Everyone, be very safe. 
very bad Frigidaire. Going to be more worse than before. And probably, and maybe, for Polar Vortex. So everyone, hope you guys like this video, and bye.